Yeah, and yeah, it's yeah. trying to do like this. Yeah. Okay, which is blocking, you know, you're blocking yourself. All right, can't quite get the guillotine like this. You take his arm out here, go across the face here, and you come up on the neck, and then you just push it up on the neck. And that's a front cross face. In order to get a guillotine here, this arm has to come on the outside here, and you have to be underneath just the neck instead of blocking because you block with your own arm. So you don't want to be on this side of it. Be on this side is better, and then just not like this. Okay. All right. So he's got again, him, he's got him like this, which is right again. The, the shoulders up to come up to protect your neck. If your neck's sticking out like this, it's over. You're finished. So back up a second. As he comes up to get the neck, I bring the shoulders up. Again, you got to pull the arms down. Just pull, pull down. Whatever you have to do to get in. Pull, pull until you get an arm out. I'm gonna go on this side here just to reverse arm bar, just hanging out the ground. I gotta reverse arm bar because I'm on the outside of the arm. If I stay on the inside, I just shoot and do double leg takedown. So if I'm just here like this, shoulders come up again, pull straight down, get out. Yep, straight down. Take them straight down, single leg, double leg takedown, whichever one comes. But technically, it'd probably be a lot better since you already had me to go to reverse armbar only because you already gave that to me. Once I take you down like this, we're both at equal lengths again. Yeah. Keeping that, it's, you know, your arms there, I can just go right to reverse armbar. Yeah. And so this side was better, yeah, this side was better yeah. to get because that's the side for the reverse armbar. That's the outside, this was the inside arm. Yeah. Go get the inside arm. 